Yeah, hopefully this is a sign that we are indeed going to get Star Wars in Disney Infinity 3.0. <laughs> Hey everyone, Wes here for Family Gamer TV with some interesting Disney Infinity news. If you're a fan of Disney Infinity, and if you're a fan specifically of Star Wars, you might be excited about what we've got to say today. Now looking ahead this year, we think we're going to get another version of Disney Infinity, one which has some Star Wars content in it. But in the meantime, wouldn't it be great if they introduced some Star Wars stuff? to the current version of Disney Infinity. That'd be pretty good, I think. Now, if you've collected all of the characters in Disney Infinity 1.0, you may have unlocked some lightsabers. Yep, you can do that if you have them all. Uh, you can put them all and get them all in the Hall of Heroes, and you should be able to play with some lightsabers. However, if you haven't managed to do that, and you'd like a Star Wars item or two in your game, well, one has been introduced. Don't know how, don't know why, what has made this magical thing happen, but it's there in a particular toy box. If you ha go into the toy boxes in Disney Infinity 2 and you load up one called Marvel Arena, and we'll just dig this out. I'm in it at the moment, but if you need to load it, you're looking for one called Marvel Arena. It's got a ton of content in there, but not just Marvel content, no. Because there's something from Star Wars, but what is it? Well, maybe did you see it? Did you see it on the side of the screen there? What is it? Can you see? What, what, what's around this corner? What is it? Do you recognize that? Oh my god! That is Luke Skywalker's land speeder from Star Wars Episode Four: A New Hope. And look at that. Hulk can just hop in, back it up, turn around, and he's away. Yep, we have our first, well, if you don't count the lightsabers, that is, we have our first Star Wars item in Disney Infinity 2.0. And hopefully this bodes well for the future. Hopefully this is a sign that we are indeed going to get Star Wars in Disney Infinity 3.0 with lots more items than this, and look, if you fly around, the bonnet opens on it, if you even call it a bonnet. Uh, in America, that would be hood, I guess. Oh, and crash, flip, bang, uh, kind of stuck. Ah, I'm dead. Uh, so, yeah, you, so you can see Hulk there driving around. We'll spin that around, give you a good look at it. Pretty cool, I think. Pretty cool. And you can bring that up from the in-game menu, so let's do that. Uh, so if you go into spark mode, oop, I'm in the wrong wrong place. If you go into spark mode, you can move around, and there's loads and loads of objects in here. So there's loads of cars. So you can see all these normal cars that we've seen before. There might be some vehicles in here you've not seen, but we've got the Tron vehicles, which are awesome. Love the Tron vehicles, and there's some Tron characters coming too. But if we scroll through these, and sorry you can't see the on-screen menu here because I'm on the Wii U, but if we scroll through these, there it is. There is the land speeder. And you put that in, play with that, and this toy box is editable. So you can strip everything out of here and create your own, own toy box that includes the land speeder as well. Brilliant. So, Star Wars fans, Disney Infinity fans, let us know what you're excited about. Are you going to get on there and download this? Are you going to play with the land speeder? Are you excited for it? What other Star Wars content do you want to see in the game? whether it be 2.0 or whether it be 3.0. And do you think 3.0 is going to be Star Wars themed? Surely it's got to be. So that's our, our little look at the land speeder in Disney Infinity 2. Remember, it's the Marvel Arena toy box that you want to be downloading. So get on that. Let us know what you think. We're excited to try and maybe make a racetrack that uses the land speeder, or maybe we'll try and replicate Tatooine. Um, it's time for me to get my build on, I think. Anyway, that's it for today. Leave us a comment, let us know what you think. And of course, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any of our Disney Infinity videos or any other content here at the channel. But until next time, stay tuned to Family Gamer TV.